morning guys today is monday july 20th and it's my birthday i don't really have too much planned for today um i'm planning to just stay in have a nice chill day because i think the city is technically reopened but me being the paranoid person that i am i still don't really feel too comfortable taking the subway and i also don't want to like force my friends to go out and like celebrate with me um so yeah i think today is also supposed to be like 96 degrees so staying in with ac and food sounds like an amazing day to me <laughs> but the first thing that i want to do today is journal because it has been a hot minute since i last journaled and i actually got myself a new journal to kind of help like re-inspire me um and i usually like to do like a little self-reflection each year um just to go over stuff that i've learned stuff that i'm grateful for and especially 2020 has taught me to be grateful for so many things so yeah let's go so this is the journal that i got i wanted to change it up from the usual black ones that i get um and i chose blank pages because i wasn't sure if i wanted to eventually use this as a sketchbook um so yeah <laughs> i'm just going to add a little gudetama sticker lovely birthday breakfast with scrambled eggs, bacon, and strawberries. And I'm just going to eat this while I start. It's okay not to be okay because I've heard a lot of good things about it. So I'm going to put on some makeup, nothing too crazy, but just so I feel a little bit cute today. So for brows, I'm going to be using the Wander Beauty Brow Gel. This has been my favorite brow gel just because it's so buildable. Um, so I've really just been doing this and I've been skipping like actually penciling them in, which is great because I'm lazy. <laughs> supernatural and as you guys can tell there definitely is a difference <laughs> all right i think those look even good enough <laughs> for eyeshadow i'm going to be using my urban decay naked cherry palette and i'm just going to use this shade right here turn on um and just do a light sweep over my eyes and then I'm going to use Ambitious and apply it to my lash line. Wow, I said that I was not going to do anything too crazy, but I feel like this is already starting to look a bit heavy, no? I mean, I don't know, maybe just because I haven't worn makeup in so long. Next, I'm going to be using the female essence mascara base and i find that this really helps just hold the curl in my lashes because my lashes are very just like short and straight but this helps them look a lot longer and helps them stay curled all day and while my mascara base is drying i'm going to go ahead and apply my lippy this is a generation g in cake just a very pretty what is it called my lips 
the better shade. So for mascara, I actually use two. This is the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara and I swear that this is the best lengthening mascara for short Asian lashes. And then just to add some more volume, I'll go in with the Wander Beauty Mile High Club and I've been using this like combination for I think over a year and I always get compliments on my lashes saying that they look really long even though they're not. Um, so yeah, this is my, I guess my little secret. <laughs> Alright, so here are my lashes with just the L'Oreal Telescopic. Obviously, there is a big difference. And then this is after the Mile High. So this is the finished look. It's pretty much my everyday makeup minus the eyeshadow. Um, so now it is time to change out of my PJs. So before I get changed, I actually just had something delivered to me, so I thought that I'd open it really quickly. Oh my god! They're flowers! Oh, they're so pretty! Oh my god, wait, there's two! What the heck? Wait, where's the straw? So this is what I threw on. It's pretty casual because I'm just planning to stay indoors and I do want to stay comfortable. Um, but this top is from Princess Polly and I actually just featured this in a haul that I believe by the time that this video is out, it should be up. So I will link it in one of these corners. I always forget which one it is. Um, and then for jeans, I'm wearing these distressed jeans from Yes Style, which I wear all the time. And then for jewelry, I'm wearing these little cancer earrings that my friend Michelle actually got for me. So thank you, Michelle, if you're watching this. I love them. And then I always get questions on this necklace. I got this necklace from, I think, A Top Jewelry in Chinatown here in New York. Um, so yeah, <laughs> that's the fit. And now it is time to get some work done. It's a oh. microfiber <laughs> cleaning cloth that came with one of the wow. items. <laughs> GWP! <laughs> GWP! <laughs> I'm like, this gotta be presentable. Oh, thanks, oh, thanks. Yeah. For your Polaroid game. <laughs> I want I I to win this. <laughs> Is it? <laughs> what could it be? What could it be? Oh, 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 oh. Yay! Oh, oh. oh my god. I need to take my Polaroid out when we can all see each other again. Okay. Like ripping Just rip it. Just it's like ripping. It's so pretty to rip. No, it's not. <gasps> it's a printer. Yay! <laughs> That's why we're like, yeah, take, take your camera out. <laughs> Like, oh yeah! Wait, so I can just print from my phone now? Yeah, you just like Bluetooth connect to it, and then you could choose any of your um, photo, and you could also add like filter on it slash like little the cute designs. Ooh, oh my god! I can add more Polaroids to my wall. Yeah. Yay! Thanks, guys. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Did you want this? Huh? Are you excited? Oh. Yeah. Pro gamer. Oh my god, Simon, what the heck? Simon, how are you sleeping? So we're like, we're like trying to think about like what to get you and everything. And we're like, I think she already has that. Oh, we're gonna get you the paint. Yeah, we were gonna get the paint. And I was like, no, 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 we can't yeah. get the paint. Yeah, I'm like, oh, the gals are really popular on TikTok. Yellow. 
Yeah. At least we guessed right. At yeah. least we knew we were on the right track. She was just one step ahead of us, always. Yeah. I've just been too, doing too much shopping in quarantine. Yeah, like we were gonna get you a plant, and I'm like, she posted an IG post with a plant. I'm pretty sure <laughs> she got a plant. Oh, yeah, and then you, you, you pulled them. Oh, Zoe. Hmm? Um, do you want to put them at Island later since they have, like, so Zucker could talk to you? <gasps> you have, I'm so fucking jealous. Holy shit. Yeah, but Dad texted Zoe. Come around like 6.30. Huh? Zoe, you hear
<laughs> what? Oh wait, oh my god. <laughs> wait, oh my god, I keep dropping it. It's been that long. Open. Oh wait, paper bag. <laughs> oh no, my pockets are full. <laughs> Okay, I'm a. I just said I, it. I, I, it I dropped you a weed. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mom's plushie. Dollar. Oh, oh crap. Oh my god. So weird. <laughs> oh, the mom's plushie. Oh my god, a pet bed. Double bed. Oh, small pocket. <laughs> I'm sorry, my pockets are full. <laughs> Here's some hardwood. <laughs> and then. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, okay, uh, here, here's, here's, here's some wood. <laughs> and you weren't saying. Oh, come on. Oh, thanks, guys. <laughs> Really blow your candles out. How? Oh, that actually works. Oh, he's just turning them on. Hey, <laughs> thank you guys. Oh my god, it's so cute. I'm so shook. Hello guys, it is the next day and oh my goodness, I am just feeling very overwhelmed by all the love and kindness that I received this year. Um, thank you guys so much for all the birthday wishes and yeah, I'm honestly just speechless. I just feel so so beyond grateful to have such amazing people in my life and I feel so abundant with love and joy and it honestly just makes me want to just like put it back into the world because I want everyone in my life to feel like as loved and happy as I do because it's an amazing feeling and I think that everyone deserves to feel like this and I swear I'm really not trying to just rub my happiness in your guys' faces um, I guess I just wanted to take this time to open up with you guys um, because I was doing a lot of thinking last night and I was just thinking about how different my life is now compared to like even a few years ago um, because if I'm being completely honest with you guys, my birthday was never like the most happiest times for me um, because I feel like it was just a day that reminded me that I never really had that many friends and I was never one of those types of people where I made a super big deal out of my birthday um, but I guess at the same time I couldn't help but compare when I saw other people had these like big birthday parties with like their groups of friends and I just I never had that um, I feel like I'm the type of person where I have like one or two really close friends and I usually celebrate with them and like there's nothing wrong with that i think it's just you know saying grass is always greener on the other side and even to this day i wouldn't say that i have quote unquote a lot of friends um especially compared to my friends who grew up here so they have their high school and middle school friends um but if i were to just compare like where i am today versus where i was like a few years ago or i mean even like my whole childhood growing up um i would definitely say that i made like progress i mean i may not have a lot of friends compared to other people but the friends that i do have i can honestly say that they're there for me that they genuinely want the best for me which is sometimes hard to find in a friend 
um so when i just think about like where i was back then versus where i am now it just makes me like cherish my friendships with those people even more and i just never want to take having fr these friends for granted so i guess the whole moral of all of this is that you know if you are feeling alone and like you don't have that many people in your life um just know that you're not alone you know i feel like basically everyone goes through these feelings um and just know that it does get better even though i know when you're feeling like that like it feels like you're never gonna make friends um but you will and it just takes time some people longer than others i mean i've lived in new york for i think six years now and i finally have like a solid core group of friends um so yeah just wanted to give you guys a little bit of hope and again thank you guys so much for all the birthday love um i actually didn't really celebrate my birthday too too much or i guess i didn't plan on celebrating my birthday too much on my birthday because um lenny actually surprised me the day before my birthday which i will insert the clips after this um but then i ended up still celebrating because she surprised me again um so yeah again thank you guys so much and i love you guys and yeah okay hi <laughs> love you Grab your finger. <laughs> Have a good day. Thank you. You woo, make a wish. Oh wait, oh I think you're supposed to take the plastic off first, right? The ribbon. Oh. The ribbon. <laughs> Harvey. <laughs> oh, that was good. Harvey. <laughs>